guys so <laughs> oh my gosh this is it's not funny like i'm laughing but this is not funny at all so i've been locked out of the room for almost like three four hours because hobby went to bible study today guys so i tried as much as possible to open up this door i couldn't do it so i literally have been standing here waiting for hobby ace went and you know like all this and padlock that you lock from the inside right like if you twist this without knowing and then if you bang the door right once you bang the door it locks that is what we've literally been here struggling like hubby i've been struggling to open this door this 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 is AC, oh my gosh. It's only a baby. Ah, it's only a baby. Ace, Ace never does anything wrong. When it comes to my husband, Ace never does anything wrong, guys. Like, babe, how, like, it, and he likes to go on that lock and be clicking it. Like, click it, click it, clicking, clicking, up and down. Now, look at, I can't even take off my makeup. I've been, like, I literally have been standing here, honestly. I was cold. I couldn't take off my makeup. He like just went in there and just. Thank God, no. Thank, not the funny thing. Thank God he wasn't in there, and then locked himself because that would have been another story altogether. Just imagine struggling like this to open up this door and then to know Ace is inside there. Hey, Jesus Christ! I'm exhausted. I needed to like take off my makeup, my makeup wipe, my makeup remover. Everything is inside that room. Baby, you can still can't open it. I'm gonna get it. I'm tired. So. Oh, fuck! <laughs> hey, Ace, yeah, che. Honestly, every woman should experience like every woman should experience motherhood because eh, it's not even funny at all. It's not funny. Sometimes it's like you're so it's like it's you can't complain, right? But still, sometimes it's like oh my gosh finally hey let me go and take off my makeup man ah oh, ac ac it's the smallest person in this house hey 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 this child ac leave that fireplace alone please that hey ac leave that alone this child always like to go to the fireplace hey, thank god he can't put it on nice he can he always knows how to put it i guess he's pressing the wrong oh it came on Essie, what you doing what you doing why are you putting on the fireplace is hey oh my gosh Essie, you better go put that off hey hey go put that off Go put that off. Hey, 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 hey. Go, go put it off. Hey, go over there. AC, go put it off, please. No? Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys. So we have an ongoing project. Like we have um, our staircase we are currently, you know, working on. After which we're going to be working on this living room. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I can't wait to get rid of all this, um, you know, the internet, modem, and all those things. There's how people do it, whereby, like, they hide it behind the TV. So, that is um, what we're going to be doing. And also, we're going to put some kind of shelves. We're going to be shelving here and here. Of course, this is got to go. But I can't even wait. Like, I'm so excited. Even the fireplace, too. We have to fit the fireplace inside. You see how it's protruding out? It's not supposed to be so. So definitely, they are going to be kind of fixing the fireplace, doing a new um, shelving for here. I can't even wait. One thing about home is there's AC. Oh, no, no, what? Oh, what is this child that is my that is giving always giving me headache? AC. Your sisters are in school. You're always the you. This one keeps me keeps me on my toe two four seven. Esinta, I always call him Esinta. The father said, "Stop calling him Esinta." Es. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. So this couch, I have 
this couch right here i listed on my facebook marketplace i need to stand this off because i had this and then i got this um these two sets so i needed to i am um, what is it called wayfair actually sent me this and kind of there was a fold right here i told them i wasn't having it so they had to send a replace this you can not be quite be while on table so they had to send a replacement and now i'm just gonna sell this one off on my amazon marketplace ace ace oh my gosh it's a move please but yeah i'm so excited with this um you know living room that chair gotta go i'm just putting it there for now i actually have somebody that is supposed to be coming to pick it up i think tomorrow so i just put the chair right there hey see hey hey you see your sisters are coming back so at least uh, I, I can it's just that they are they are, they, they called they called earlier it's um after one they usually come out of school around three but they called that they an angel called she wasn't feeling well so we went to pick them up and um yeah let's see what's going on she said they ate um hamburger in school and the hamburger got her sick or something hey mister it's like your sisters are back hmm? <laughs> hey see your sisters are back daddy pool Hey, mister. Hey. Hey. Chimo, ato palmato. Hey. Hey. Oh, my gosh. It's going for the second one. Hey. You see your life. You see your life. <laughs> What you gonna say now? Oh, you're not done yet. Hey. <sighs> oh, oh, nah. oh, no. What happened, guys? How come you came? You, you, what, what happened? Angel had a set. Um, Angel had what? Because of the food in school. Which food? So what, what happened? You decided to carry yourself back early from school. No, it's just that you stayed on. Ah, look at that. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it makes you feel weak. That's why you're three hours. You came back three hours before. You know what? I'm happy that I didn't eat the hamburger. I told her to try it out, and then she kept taking bites. And then you know what happened? I never tried it out. Oh my gosh, you guys! So <laughs> I have uh, my nail appointment and. Oh, I'm kind of two minutes late. I'm over here waiting for the light to go. Oh my gosh. It's not easy, man. Like just running. Up. Look at this one. That, I don't understand how people are just so comfortable. You see the light change, right? And you're just walking and they're not even running. They are lucky they're in America. If it was in Nigeria, they would just scatter your leg and be going. Like as if I'm standing here, as if I'm a fool. You know, to be standing here and waiting for the light to change for me. Somebody saw the light, you know, changed for the cars to for the cars to start going. He was just strolling right down the, the road. Crazy people. Oh my gosh, where? Oh, okay. Right here. Hi. Hi. Hi guys, how are you? Hi. 
How you guys? Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Oh my gosh, guys. So we're on our way to my sister-in-law's. We're on our way to Yawande's house and we are so excited, guys. Yeah. She just um, bought a house. You guys, like, it was crazy. I would say, Yawande, mommy, can you reduce the volume? Is that a season phone? Yeah, that's Yeah, that's fine. So, um, honestly, I would say Yawande was um, one person that took, a, I wouldn't say a more heat, but she took a very big heat when my mom-in-law passed guys because she live in the same building with my mom-in-law and they've just imagined i know a lot of people you know lose loved loved ones and they're still able to like cope with the memories of the loved one in the house and everything maybe seeing their property seeing their clothes and all those things but with us right we felt it so bad like mm -hmm. just imagine we used to say we don't know how your one day feels because she she lives right in the same building with mom so after mom passed guys like if you notice throughout last year she was always in our you know with us she was always you know spending time with us her and her kids so we've been looking for a house so at least she can move and maybe just you know start a new life in terms of like you know with the memory of everything that passed i mean mommy's car is still packed there she literally have to um, like walk from mommy's house to her own house so it was just uh, more like um i don't even know the right word to use you know so we really knew she needed to move just to get a clear head you know just imagine having to walk every like having to see or having the memory of your mom like always like there with you you know when you are sleeping when you wake up when you go out everything i mean we carry mom's memory in our hearts but i'm just saying in terms of always being in that house so we knew she needed to move and we are so happy she finally got a place and mm -hmm. this is going to be our first time going to go see her her mm -hmm. house so we are actually so excited and i'm just so happy for her at least you know i remember when we were getting ready for mom's funeral and everything whenever we go to mom's house like like we get so depressed you know we couldn't even think straight and i used to wonder how she felt like when we all leave like she's just there with mom's husband and everything oh how busy i don't want to talk about mom but you know we're just so happy that um and we're just so happy that she got the house so we're on our way to go it's kind of um what is it called ha um, home warming right babe is that what you guys call it home warming we're kind of going for home warming you know for her we have some things at the back as you are, you guys can see like the back is so messed up mr man is over there on his um on his um what is it called on his phone it's don't even want to be able, ah youtube is gonna strike me come on <laughs> Ace don't want to be bothered once he enters the car and he once once he enters the car and you put on his um phone. his phone the cartoon on his phone that's all he wants to so see that's all he wants to to, to even like talk about look at him look at him. <laughs> but yeah guys we're on our way we're gonna see you guys shortly we just picked up um papa's of course we had to take something eatable too because the kids is actually friday so it's kind of um we're just ac uh oh i just talked about him not bothering nobody and now he decides to oh his so, thing's down oh it's down i see the the phone is dead no it, it's just the volume i see <laughs> oh my gosh see, oh yes i'm filming since your house is beautiful oh my gosh i just i love i love the arrangements man oh my god mm. it was warmer earlier though yeah. it was yeah it was, it was Ooh, it's cold though look at him oh it's cold though jesus what happened it just got cold all of a sudden oh my god it's baby. Baby. oh my gosh <laughs> Helping herself out. Uh -uh. Did you carry your things? Oh my god. <laughs> Get the new papayas, guys. Oh, you yeah, want the papayas? Yeah, we have to grab the papayas. Oh, since this is beautiful. Oh, I have them here. Um, what you call it? Uh, pizza, too. Oh, since I love the color. Yeah. I love this pop of green. Oh so, my gosh. Mm -hmm. I love the rug. Oh, oh, I love that. Mom's name. Oh, so cute. Look at this, girl. Ah! <laughs> Why is he peeping? Well, what are you 
gone you're in the kitchen no they're, they're, oh, the aroma they're, 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 Oh, my hi. Where is um, J, um, Judah? Oh, yeah. Sis, look at this. I love, look at, I, oh my God. <laughs> I love it. I'm telling you, I love the pop of color. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for you, honestly. Come give me a hug. I'm just so happy. Honestly, I'm so happy look for you. Look at what I made for mommy. Aww. I kind of made the whole place oh, yeah. a tribute. Yeah. Yeah. This, I'm so happy. You don't even understand. <laughs> Just being able to I have, you know, your own space. Your own space. Yeah. There's nothing like that. Honestly. We're still unpacking. I know. I understand. But at least, look, you already fixed up everywhere. I was expecting like boxes and things, but you know. Wow. Oh, look at mom's picture. This is so cute. Aww. You know we have a big one of her too in the living room. We have to install it. Oh mm -hmm. yeah, hang it. Um, probably yeah. like here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they like they need to hang it up there. Yeah. Right? Not up, but probably from here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, oh, sorry. Sorry. Ah. I'm just imagining if she was here, just seeing this, like it's your house. Mm -hmm. Mommy would have been so happy. So happy, man. Yeah. I love oh, the animals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my they're god. Running around. So happy. Honestly, I'm so happy. Like, so, so happy for my sister in law. I just love the fact that, like, she has a lot of color. I'm the type of. I actually love colors, you know? So, <clears throat> what I do is I keep my chairs neutral and then I'm able to kind of um, interchange with my pillows and just like the, the accessories to kind of create whatever pop of color i want whether it's blue pink mommy watch him or watch him whether it's blue pink yellow or anything but you see this the blue and that pink oh my gosh it's such a like a lovely combo i i really love it honestly i'm going to do something like this maybe for the office you know have a pink and a blue i really love the two colors but her house is beautiful i love it and she's a, a lover of animals like she has a lot of um guinea pig and all those things that i'm so happy she's now able to kind of have all those you know animals in her house they have the upstairs the basement and everything is so cute so beautiful honestly what happened what did i do wrong what happened so no, it was um the neighbor. Oh, oh. the landlord and the neighbor. Oh, so you have that. You're gonna send me that picture because we need it for the house. The picture Which of you one? and the boys. Remember I was telling oh, you. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, what drink is that? Judah, Jess, what drink is that? Yeah, I want it, something. Um, uh, yeah. Pictures done this week. Oh, it's, it's cold. So I need your. Picture. Oh, it's cold. Okay, so give me a drink. I will use it for now. Yeah, one day can I have the drink? Yeah. Okay. Of Please. So you go take a look at her bathroom. I just I saw it. It's beautiful. You, you can do the same thing with the new one. Yeah. Let's just stop touching stuff. And see. He has his toys in his bag. No, even if there's you provide toys for AC, AC will leave those toys and go to where he's not supposed to go. AC. Aperture. So you think he's bigger than what you thought he would be? No. Yeah. He's the right size. He's the right size, right? He's the right size. Take your photo. How about that? Mm. Since so what kind of cola is this one? Healthy cola? <laughs> yes, sis. You know what you're trying to say, yeah? No, 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 but <laughs> she's so into me. health and things like that. But it tastes good though. It's quick and cola, sweetie. Yeah, it's natural soda. Oh, yeah. supposedly. Yeah, this time, mm. um, it's, I like it's it. Natural and then... Oh my gosh, you guys, guess what I have in here? Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I have a story for this because. This has been a pen in the butt. Guess, just guess, guess before I open up the the package. Guess, can you guess what I have in here, guys? Oh my gosh, it literally just got delivered. Come on, camera. I have to put my camera on a tripod. I don't even know if you guys can see me, but let me see. Let me just put it on a tripod. I have. All the way from Nigeria, like it's been when was the last time we were in Nigeria? Five years ago. 
it's been over five years i had this guys this is a popular a well-known fruit in nigeria and this is the season ah wow no more guys i have this one i've already oh my gosh i knew it about the more fruits they really don't last that that um, much it's always like you buy it and you eat it immediately but guys look at this this is kind of always like the original it kind of has a yellow orangey color but as you as you guys can see because of the fact that it was shipped you know you won't believe it this five piece right here is 25 dollars i think 10 piece is um 50 dollars five piece 25 dollars you can imagine but i was craving for a bottle for so much that i was just like you know what let me just try and another thing is the fruit you always have to make sure that the like the one you're getting is the sweet one a bottle more has very bitter ones and the sweet ones hopefully these ones are sweet i was like let me just get um the five piece you know to try and see if the vendor it, you know if the abaloma is sweet then i can now go back for more maybe hundred dollar one but guys you won't even hey let me wash it hold on you guys i have a story about this abaloma like it's crazy so last sometime last month was it last month yeah i think last month of course i'm so privileged to meet a lot of amazing women here you know on youtube some are also in nigeria so a friend of mine she's also a youtuber here lily pope she had um we had you know connected and we were just gisting i was like you know telling her about the things i don't have no more so she decided to kind of um ship me a package of Nigerian foodstuffs. We had a lot of foodstuffs in there, or like Oha, Oba, Abalomo. She actually sent me a penta. And you guys, like Abalomo is my favorite fruit. So since I came here, we we don't see it here, you know. So my dear, she 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 had bought me some things. Oh my gosh, bless this. Excuse me, bless, bless this um, fruit too. You just press our Lord, Amen. Hmm, they can have bitter ones, so and then su extremely sweet ones i just pray this is the sweet one. Oh my gosh ah. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh this one threw me out of my seat oh you see you see why it's always good to taste first of all before buying a lot this is mm -mm. this is not sweet at all but you know one it's even bringing out it's makes it's making my mouth salivate but you know what i don't have option this is not sweet at all upon the lady said it's sweet so let me tell you guys the story so she got in contact with this um, shipping company in nigeria was it shirley exports or whatever the so-called name they gave the company right she got in contact with them and the, the business was like oh that they are going to deliver the the package to me in america in less than 72 hours you know if you're if you're familiar with the nigerian businesses you know how they can hype things they will hype it hype it hype it hype it make you believe that you know oh everything is going to go perfectly well my dear 72 hours she bought the things for me shipped it with the company I mean, throughout that week, my whole attention was outside, you know, once I hear kind of a delivery truck close to my house, I'll run out to go and see if it was there. My dear, after probably three, four or five days, we were like, what's going on? She had to reach out um, to the company in Nigeria to ask them what is going on, like, what's the, where's the package? The woman started with a story that the package came to the US and the custom seized it then she don't know what was going on but somebody was going to reach out to me here in america an agent of hers here in america is going to reach out to me uh, blah 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 so finally the area the agent reached out and said oh unfortunately all the goods that was sent to me from nigeria got um got caught by customs it was contraband and customs burnt it right they said they were only able to they, they burnt the abalomo mind you like for five years now i haven't had abalomo even though abalomo like i've been craving for abalomo but i've been able to like hold my throat you know because i know it wasn't accessible but ever since i started talking 
to Lily, you know, and um, she was like, oh, she's going to ship me uh, a bottle. I was so excited. My whole throat, I just couldn't wait to have this fruit. This, this fruit was one fruit that I really, really craved for when I was pregnant with AIDS, but I couldn't get it, guys. So finally... They got um, they got in contact to um, to me and they told me oh they seized everything they burnt everything it was only Oba or something that was left guess what they said I should pay hundred and forty dollars or something for them to ship me the Oba from Texas to the U S to to New Jersey here we're not talking of international shipping we're talking of from Texas mind you I have a family in Texas that she like when she goes to Nigeria she ships me things at most. $25, $30, I receive things, but this particular book, please, if you, anywhere you hear about Shelly Exports Food Company or what, the, it's not food shipping company, please run from them, those people are scammed, they are not serious at all. Immediately, the woman, the woman um, sent me the message that I should pay them $140 for them to ship the few things that was left from the ones they said was burnt because it was later i started to hear that some of them bring things here and tell the owners that those things were seized and then they go behind you know the owners and resell them because this one right here after that that thing happened i told the lady i said i'm not paying nothing i'm definitely not paying any money so i stopped communicating with the lady only god knows what she did with my package right because the package i think i was supposed to receive about five different things and four of those things got burnt like got seized by customs it was only one and it was that one she said i should pay a hundred and almost 150 dollars for i said no ma'am just hold it have it so usually what they do is they go and sell it or whatever but i had to research oh jesus i'm so disappointed mm, utterly disappointed guys oh my gosh but honestly i'm gonna eat it and chew the, the skin because I have craved just the taste and the smell alone. I'm just happy having it in my hand. So I had to research on where to, I couldn't just control my throat anymore. You know, after I got disappointed from the one that was supposed to be shipped to me from Nigeria, I had to research and then I found out a shop, like they have a lot of stores in Itzy. So if you've been craving for a while or more, surprisingly Itzy, they sell abalomo in, um, on Etsy, so you can go check. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is so bitter, guys. Oh, mm. it has um, a seed. Just imagine the last time I was in Nigeria, I was like, that I was going to come over with the seed to the US and plant it. And hopefully it will grow into a baluma. So at least I will have a baluma in the US. And I never did. Maybe I will try it since it's almost spring. This is the right time to. Mm. You guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> the tin has a lot of juice. This is the um this is the best time people start to plant and you know and cultivate. So maybe since I it's just that I can't even plant this one because this one is bitter, it's not the sweet one. Hey! If you see, there's the one they call Ijesha, uh, Abwalomo Ijesha from Abwal, um, Abwalomo from Ijesha. Hey, so sweet. Mm. Something else. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, you know how, have somebody given you a dirty slap? <laughs> That's how I feel with this Abwalomo. It's so bitter. But... <clears throat> I'm not going to throw it out. Please, if you have any suggestion or anybody that sells sweet abalomo, that you're very confident that I'm going to get my abalomo sweet too. Because as you, all, as you all can see, I got this one, but it's not sweet at all. It's not sweet, but, I, but at least they sell it on Etsy. But guys, hmm, with everything going on in the world, it's just crazy hearing about this um ukraine russia thing it's like what is really wrong with the world it's like people are trying to breathe this next minute something is happening the next minute you're trying to breathe and then something else comes up i i really don't understand how in the 21st century with all the social media and everything the technology and everything going on 
right before our eyes guys a country just invades another country and want to take another country like it you know when this thing started we thought it was a joke we were like oh like putin he wasn't serious until they launched the attack on ukraine like what the hell this is 2022 guys this is not um 1940s and 1930s like this is 2022 for christ's sake broad daylight like this you want to take over take over a country i really it's so it's so it's so oddly disappointing like i i really don't understand and to think to him he thinks he's gonna win this war there's no how there's no how they will win the war this war it's not possible the unfortunate thing is that it's affecting a lot of families there was this video i watched online of a baby hell gosh I was just thinking of Ace, you know, little Ace that doesn't know nothing, going through this in a, like a war. And somebody told us, somebody actually left me a comment the other day. She said, you guys better watch out in, a, in America. Putin is coming to America. Like he's going to launch an attack on America. I said, these days, you can't even leave your house. Like you can't leave your house or do anything without praying. Because all we need right now in the world is God's protection and intervention. Because you know, they... The irony of all these things is it was it's actually right in the Bible. That's the irony of all these things. So this is something that is not going to go away. It's just going to get worse and worse and worse and worse until Jesus coming. Like if you read your Bible, you would know that what is going on in the world right now is actually in the Bible. So it's not something you'll be like, oh, let me like let's pray against it so it doesn't happen. It's written in the Bible. Like it's something you can't you can't do anything about it. All you just need to do is just pray for God's protection and intervention because it's there it's written and i think there is a time that will come that um russia is gonna join with china to fight israel or something like that if you read your bible you understand what i'm saying but what is happening in the world right now is nothing far-fetched it's actually bi biblical it's you know it's right in your bible and look 2020 we all went through corona they actually said something worse than corona is coming only god knows what it is it's, it's crazy hi jesus mm -mm. you guys i don't even know what is going on with this abaluma my kids when we go to nigeria they love this fruit a lot but with this one I'm sure they won't want to be bothered at all. Hey, so bitter. You know how when you eat something and then you talk, when air touches your teeth, it kind of tickles. That's what this is doing. Oh my gosh, but I can't just throw this about me away. It's not possible. <laughs> As a Nigerian woman, I'm going to finish it. Oh my gosh. Hi. Mm -mm. Hi. Honestly, eh? this fruit is the type of thing that will make me go to Nigeria. Just to go and have some abaluma and then come back to the US. Honestly, I really love this fruit, but unfortunately, it's, all, it's just from one story to the next. The one that was sent. The one they said the custom seized. Oh my gosh, my friend Lin Lin Linda was like, Oh my gosh, if you taste this abalumo, like she they have this abalumo that is also sell in Nigeria that is called Wanu. She sent me the Wanu abalumo, very sweet. Like it's as if they poured sugar and honey inside the abalumo, but unfortunately, I never got it. And this one, I ordered it $25 for five piece, $50 for 10 piece. And this is a thank God I didn't get that 10 pins because I, I don't understand.